What is going on everybody? It is Lucky Finn Gaming here and we are back in Jurassic World Evolution. Now, uh last time we were on this world, Science we had not only experimentation, but observation. And with you, I like what I see. Keep it up. Okay. Don't know where that came from. <laughs> I think it's just because my reputation with the science division is really high. Anyway, the last time we were here, we were working on releasing uh, one of the... Uh, this animal right here, the... Critch... I think we I think we decided how to pronounce this. Critch... Critchtonosaurus? Critchtonosaurus? Uh, Critchtonosaur? Uh, we were working on releasing one of these. Uh, and, but we didn't have the fossils necessary, so I just spent a, about an hour or two just sending out fossil divisions, uh, expedition teams to go get some more, and now we have it to 100%. But first, they're going to need some place to live. Well, actually, let's go ahead and get this started. We'll make... Well, hold on. Uh, defense, raiding skin... Okay, so we have to wait for their first incubation. Okay. Well, we'll just cook one up. Actually, let's go ahead and cook two up. I don't know how social or not social they're going to be. So I don't know if they're going to need a lot or just a couple. So we'll just make those two for now. Also, uh, while I was waiting on that, I revamped this cage a little bit. I ended up uh, adding like a little diagonal piece here. So that way this cage could be a little better. But anyway, let's go ahead and get some uh, stuff going in here. Right there. Eh, that may be a little much. There we go. I don't know how much forest they're going to want. There. Let's have a little water. Yeah. That's cute. It's like a little river. Yeah. Yeah, just like that. Okay. Uh. A little forest over here. Now then. What is this? Vibrant. I haven't even really looked at all of this stuff. Grass, rock, dirt. Forest. Forest. Okay. How do we add that rock? Over here in the Ceratosaur cage, we have a rock. Oh, and uh, I have some sad news for everybody. <laughs> Unfortunately, we had a couple of deaths while I was waiting. Uh, one of the Ceratosaurs, a Struthiomimus, and one of our Edmontosaurs, unfortunately, did die. Uh, Honestly, guys, I would kind of get used to that, at least for a little bit. A lot of those early dinosaurs that we had to do uh, when we didn't have complete genomes, unfortunately, they are starting to pass away. So that's that's a little sad for all of my friends who are uh, um, who are big fans and don't want to don't want to lose babies. I get it. <laughs> I don't want to lose them either. But unfortunately, that's just that's just life sometimes. So anyway, uh, let's see here. We have a tall herbivore feeder. Oh, and there goes another one, unfortunately. Uh, let's put a little herbivore feeder. Let's put it right there. And we'll uh, deactivate it for now. Okay, who did we get? Oh, we lost one of the Struthio Mimus. Struthio Mimus 4. What was your... Negative three, huh? Authenticity was only 94%. That's one that we released. It wasn't fully done yet. Well, that's unfortunate, but right, hold on. I need to get this one and then take it out. Dude, so I don't think it's like it. Hold on. Let's try that again. Asset collection request received. Okay. And 
now we have two of these guys. Oh, wow. I think I read about this one before, in a book. It's got a novel name. The Crichtonsaurus. Crichtonsaurus, huh? So, it's the Crichtonsaurus. Crichtono. I guess, I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and get it knocked out. Get it up to its new game. Wow, it really doesn't want a lot of space, huh? I made all that space and it doesn't even need that much. That's crazy. But that's okay. We'll go ahead and we'll keep that space for it. So it'll be happy. You can never have too much space, but you can always have too little space. That's what I always say. Oh wow! We are pleased to welcome a Frightensaurus to the show. Did it? I really like this one. I think you. No, no, shut up. I'm more interested in how it sounded. Did anybody else hear that? It sounds adorable. I hope y'all can't hear that. There's people working next door, right next to my recording studio, and I—they are loud. <laughs> They're being loud. They've been loud all day. I was honestly hoping that by the time I was done with my uh, asset collection with certain other things, like when I got home from work and stuff, I was really hoping that they would have uh, they would have already gotten out by now, but they have not. They're still being loud next door. They're doing some kind of work, I think, but I'm not sure, you know, what work that is. All I know is it's got a lot of uh, louds and bangings. <laughs> But anyway, let's go ahead and get these Crichtonsaurs over here. Transit has commenced. Alright guys, I'm going to take a cut here because my wife just got home. So I will see y'all after the cut. Alright guys, sorry about that cut. Like I said, my uh, dear wife came home. I want to talk to her for me. I had to see her. Oh. <laughs> Alrighty, but we got these guys moved in and let's see how they're doing. They're they got plenty of wetland. Looks like they could really do without wetland. I mean they need some for water, obviously. But uh Okay, you're just gonna go through that with the butt. That's nice. <laughs> Anyway, though, so we got some, uh, they got plenty of grass land. This cage is probably too big for them, but you know what? Oh, well, it's okay. So, they seem happy. What's their social like? Okay, so they could actually have some more in here. I've actually got pretty big social compared to some of the other, uh, species of their genus. Oh, you know what? I just realized we need a we need a gate because otherwise we're not gonna be able to get in here and refeed them. That's to be seventy thousand dollars. Huh? Maybe over here. I think if we can, we cannot. Right here? No, can't. All right, right. Here. Here ish it is. There we go. And now we have new animals, and let's see. Oh wow. That's a screenshot, right? That's a thumbnail. <laughs> That's a thumbnail. <laughs> Alright. There was one other thing I wanted to do here today with you guys, and that was get rid of this, uh, the gift shop. I It has, after all this time, multiple episodes since we put it in, it has not attracted anybody. Nobody comes to this place. We're getting two out of 240 available people, and if we increase the price on anything in this place, it just, nobody, nobody comes to it. Nobody ever comes to it. It's just costing me money. It's barely making me 
any money. So what I think we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and get rid of it. Refund $97,000. That's probably the most that thing has made me. I think I lost money on that stupid gift shop. So what we're going to do instead is I think we're going to put a new power station here. Uh, because... Building constraints, huh? Let's see if we can back it up a little. Okay. Okay. Why do you keep telling me building constraints? It's not even touching. They're literally not touching. Okay, what if we did kind of like this? Yep, it's telling me. Hmm. Okay. Kind of like this. Yep, still telling me building constraints. Okay, well that's annoying. Doesn't want to put it here. I don't know why. It's being a butt. <laughs> it's being a big booty. I don't like it. Eh. Okay, right. Okay, well that's okay. Straight with it. Well, we, this may have been a, this idea may be botch. We may not be able to do this since, okay, let's, uh, let's go to landscaping here, get rid of these trees, see what our problem is. Hmm. Looks like the problem is there's a hill here, which I mean, flatten. Can we do that? See if this helps us. Uh, it doesn't look like we can. Whoa! Hello! Oh, no! 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 That's not what we want. We want it to be lower. Okay. Get it all lowered. Okay. Power. Still saying terrain constraints, huh? Yeah. Yeah, because I don't think. I think the problem is we won't, we can't build into this hill. This is just too big to fit here. I think. That's annoying. There's a big plan here. It's not gonna work. I just hate it when that happens. You start something and it doesn't work. It's a shame. Grind shame. Well, we've already got a power station over here, so we really can't. Well, now I don't know what to put here. Get out of here. I've already got everything I need from you. <laughs> I don't need you anymore. <laughs> oh, that sounds so awful to say. It's like, well, I don't need you, so get out. <laughs> we're still working on getting this guy done I've been doing a lot of work for him off of the off camera here uh, so trying to get this trying to get that restaurant that innovation center and the Sinoceratops so that way we can complete all of them uh, get everything we can completed before moving on to the next island uh, and you know we'll continue from there <laughs> But all right, guys, like I said, my wife is home, so I'm going to go spend some time with her. So I'm going to cut this video a little short. Uh, I know that usually we have like about a 20 to 30 minute video, uh, which is really usually longer than I want them to be. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and go, guys. So I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, and if you want to see more, consider hitting that like that like and subscribe button. I mean, obviously hit the like button if you enjoyed. But if you want to see more, what an awful note to leave off on because you have a dead animal. I don't like that. Um, and that's my phone ringing in the background, so I do hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all in another time and dimension 
whenever or wherever that may be. Until then, peace out.